more local coverage now. Several events being held statewide this Veterans Day to honor those who served. And in Warwick, Operation Stand Down held a special event aimed at memorializing the fallen and helping veterans. Eyewitness News reporter Michaela McDonald continues our local coverage now live from the control room. Michaela. Mike and Shannon, I spoke with a veteran today who shared just how much one of these organizations was able to help him when he needed it. The goal of this event is to connect the resources out there with the veterans who need them. From job training to counseling services, today's Veterans Resource Fair was full of organizations ready to help. Outreach is very important with the veteran community. Uh, there are so many benefits that veterans just are not aware of. The event was put on by Operation Stand Down Rhode Island. For us at Operation Stand Down, every day is Veterans Day, but uh, this weekend obviously draws attention to veterans and for us, the plight of veterans. For 25 years, Operation Stand Down has been helping veterans in need. I got help with what I needed help with. It's an organization close to Air Force veteran Vance Hewling's heart as it helped him through one of the toughest times in his life. My wife and I almost lost a home that we've been in 21 years. Uh, it was life saving. Getting emotional. Operation Stand Down stepped in while Warwick resident Hewling was out of work for six months, providing classes and helping him find employment. They, they did a lot for me. They helped me with uh, some of my bills, my rent, food, clothing. They, they did a lot for me. And most of the organizations I spoke with today said affordable housing continues to be a huge challenge for veterans across the state. Tomorrow on Veterans Day will mark the grand opening of the new Rhode Island Veterans Home. Michaela McDonald, Eyewitness News.